it was on fire on the internet. Kayla Nicole, a model who used to date Travis Kelsey for six years, had just written a mysterious message. It said, some relationships are like catchy tunes, they stay in your head long after they're over. Is that love, or is it just comfort? The post seemed to be directed at Travis's new girlfriend, Taylor Swift. It caused a lot of rumors to spread. Taylor is known for being mysterious on social media, so her answer shocked everyone. Instead of a harsh response or nothing at all, she posted a short film. She started to play the piano while sitting at it in a golden light. It was a new tune that was soft and sad. She then sang. The whispers in the crowd, the echoes of what used to be, can they drown out the rhythm of a love that sets you free? The words were very different from what she usually writes for pop songs. This was honest and open. Love looks different from every angle. Hashtag Folklore Fridays was the only thing that showed up at the end of the movie. The internet let out a combined gasp. Taylor, who was known for casting shadows, had chosen the right path. Fans praised how mature she was, and some even thought the song might be a future single. Kayla took down her post because she was surprised by the kindness. Things had changed in the story. The following day, Travis himself joined the talk. He shared Taylor's video again with just the words, mic drop. It was clear that he loved her. What Taylor did on social media changed the next week. The chosen pictures and mysterious lyrics were no longer there. Instead, she shared real photos of herself and Travis, like a walk in the park or laughing over coffee. The comments were simple and honest. At first, the fans didn't understand, but over time, they did. It wasn't a PR stunt, it was real. She had always used her singing to talk about her life, but this time she was using it to show a different side of love. Love that wasn't always loud and flashy, but rather a quiet understanding and respect for each other. Kayla didn't say anything else. The press quickly moved on to the next fight between famous people. But Taylor Swift's fans, known as Swifties, remembered. They talked about the time their idol decided to be nice instead of make trouble, and how she started a new conversation about love in the social media age. Plus, they knew that was a tune worth keeping. It was fire on the web. Kayla Nicole, a model who used to date Travis Kelsey for six years, had just written a mysterious message. Some relationships are like catchy tunes, it said. They get stuck in your head, but the melody goes away after a while. Does yours last, or are you just looking for a chorus? Even though Travis didn't name Taylor Swift, his present girlfriend, by name, it was clear what she meant. Police from Swifty were already on the scene. Taylor is known for being mysterious on social media, so her answer shocked everyone. Instead of a harsh response or complete silence, she shared an old picture of herself with a guitar slung low and a sly grin on her face. It said, folklore for you? It's coming soon winky face. The internet let out a combined gasp. Many people thought that Taylor's surprise album Folklore, which came out in 2020 and was full of honest stories and complicated songs, was one of her most personal works. Was she going to write an entire record about the drama? The days turned into weeks. The media went crazy to an all-time high. Every vague song lyrics and every news picture were broken down and studied. After that, a single fell. There was a sad song called, Long Throw, about a love that seemed perfect but you knew wouldn't last. But the words had a surprising amount of grace instead of anger. She sang, We were a Hail Mary, a last ditch play, and her voice was full of feeling. But even touchdowns fade with the break of day. It wasn't a diss track. It wasn't an angry plea to get Travis back. It was a feeling of thought and recognition of how short love is, even strong love. The internet changed its mind, as it often does. Swifties praised Taylor for being mature. In a strange turn of events, Kayla Nicole only put a thumbs up sign under the music video. What about Travis? People were left to wonder if Long Throw hit home with him too because he didn't say anything. One thing was for sure, Taylor Swift had once again turned heartbreak into gold, showing that even the worst events can lead to beautiful art. It was fire on the web. Kayla Nicole, a model who used to date Travis Kelsey for six years, 
had just written a mysterious message. Some relationships are like fairy tales, it said, full of glitter but lacking substance. Fans thought right away that it was a jab at Travis's present girlfriend, Taylor Swift. Hashtag Swifty anger broke out. Taylor, on the other hand, was in the studio and didn't know about the social media storm. As soon as she came out, her manager told her what was going on. Swift, who is known for writing clever songs, smiled. She said, challenge accepted. Love Story, Remix, was Taylor's surprise song that came out the next day. The tune was old, but the words were fresh and new. They called it a fairy tale and rushed in with cameras, she sang, which seemed to be a reference to how much attention their relationship got from the media. But the chorus took a strange turn, but darling, even fairy tales need a bad guy, and mine just wrote a really bad review. The internet went crazy again. Fans were used to seeing Taylor cry, but this wasn't that. This was Taylor, the great entertainer, taking charge of the story. The song was an instant hit because it was catchy and had a fun tone to it. Taylor's clever response took the attention away from Kayla's post. The story wasn't over, though. After a week, Kayla put up a film. There was no longer any anger. Respect to Taylor, she said with a silly smile. That song was hot. Even if it's not the same person, we all deserve happy ends. Taylor sent back a simple tweet that said, Girl power. Because the internet is so moody, everyone went crazy over the two women's newfound respect for each other. Travis, who was in the middle, just laughed. His love life might be in the news, but at least his girlfriend was the pop queen. A model named Kayla Nicole, who used to date Travis Kelsey for six years, shared a mysterious message that made the internet gasp. Some relationships are like catchy tunes, it said, all fun and glitter on the outside, but fade away quicker than a summer romance. There were a lot of rumors that it had something to do with Travis's new girlfriend, Taylor Swift. Taylor is known for being mysterious on social media, so her answer shocked everyone. There was either a harsh response or nothing at all. Instead, she posted a picture. The sides of the old Polaroid picture were worn, and it showed Taylor when she was younger, maybe 15 years old, with a homemade guitar on her back. It had one line that said, my love stories may be songs, but they're always real. The internet broke up. Swifties, Taylor's most loyal fans, came together to support her. Worldwide, hashtag real love from Taylor became a trend. Music critics found old talks with Taylor in which she talked about how vulnerable and honest her songs are. Even some of Kayla's fans agreed that Taylor's answer showed how mature she was. But Kayla wasn't going to give up. When she posted a selfie with tears on her face, she wrote, sometimes even the strongest melodies can't drown out the truth. The answer wasn't as one-sided this time. Some people thought Kayla should be able to speak out, while others thought she was being too victimized. The media went crazy to an all-time high. There was talk on talk shows and in the news about the shade war, and reporters followed Taylor and Travis around like hawks. But the couple didn't say a word, which was very different from what was happening online. After a few weeks, Taylor put out a new song. It wasn't an upbeat hit song or a sad ballad. The acoustic melody was simple, and the words were honest and felt-based. She sang about how complicated love is, how scary it is to be judged, and how brave it is to be open. The song, which was called, The Story We Write, hit home with fans. It wasn't a defense or a diss track, it was a reflection on the power of real relationship over time. For once, the internet paid attention. The subject changed from fake drama to the messy beauty of real relationships. Kayla never directly talked about Taylor again, but her posts on social media became more upbeat. Taylor and Travis kept going on dates in secret, and their love story was a quiet melody in the roar of the internet. In the end, Taylor's shocking answer, which showed how deeply she felt, showed that staying true to yourself is sometimes the best way to fight criticism.